holding on a cigarette He's in the skies deep in the dark And in a mix he knows the mark What's going on peeps? Welcome back to the Juicy Vapor channel. I'm your man Chef Andy and today we're doing an unboxing uh, and a real quick real quick review of the Tesla 3 uh, which you see right here before you uh, I realize it's been about a about a week since I've been uh, on here doing a review I've been pretty sick as you can see I'm not in my studio I'm in my man cave but I wanted to do just a very very quick unbox and review of this machine uh, I kinda like it by the way I will put the text specs down below and if you will do me a favor and like and subscribe and tell your friends about us, uh, I'd really appreciate it. Without further ado, let's just dive right on in, huh? Um, all right, so uh, again, the Tesla 3 right there. It's got your standard 5 on, 5 off type thing. It's already on, so I'm going to go ahead and... So you can see it's off, I'm going to turn it back on. There we go. The uh, spring on this is very, very tight, which I like because that'll make it last a long time. So you've really got to kind of squeeze down. Uh, when we unbox, as you can see on the back, it's got all the goody stuff about it, the bullet points. Comes with the user manual. Upside down, no less, huh? All right, we've also got the certificate of authenticity. and it comes with a USB cable Ta -da! on here you will be able to recharge the recharge port is right there it also has another feature for your USB if you want to go ahead and charge external things using your USB you can do that that's not really a selling point for me and I don't really use that on any one of my units but it's there um, just real quick, it's got a integrated 5,000 mAh battery with a 40 amp high, high drain on it. Um, this little unit right here, I, I've used it for a few days just just because I wanted to get to know it, and I will say it's pretty cool. It goes under, it goes up to 150 watts, which is which is cool. Um, I really like it because there are some tanks that I have that called for maybe a little more powerful unit um, and a little more than you know your standard 50 to 100 watt um, in particular I'm gonna go ahead and fire it up with this one's my baby beast and I found out that it works great on this machine so I'm pretty excited about that um, again please like subscribe let everybody know about us I'm gonna put all the tech specs down below uh, as you can see, like I said, we're making this a very quick unboxing. Um, yeah. So, without further ado, I'm just going to go ahead and get this on there. Just about drop my tank. Alright, we're putting the Baby Beast by Smock or Smoke, whatever, on here. Alright, I've got one of my own DIY uh, e-juices that I'm using. So, here you can see it with the Baby Beast. All right, cool, cool. All right. Yeah, baby, let's turn it to the side. How's that? All right, let me back up a little here. Sorry for the messy bed. Like I said, I've, I've been sick. Here we go. Pretty chill, huh? As you can see with my babe, by the way, you don't even have to adjust the wattage. It'll adjust itself up and down with your resistance and all that good stuff on your, on your coil. Uh, it'll pretty much do all that for you. So I will put this plug in. If you're a newbie and you want to maybe step up your game but really not quite sure uh, about the higher wattage units and where to set things at um, you know this might be a nice little unit for you because it does go to 150 watt 
And keep in mind that the baby beast still, uh, you know, this one goes from, I think, 50 to 110. Your sweet spot's are right around 60 to 80. Um, I tried some heavier tanks on here, like my big cloud beast that I got. You can see it side by side. And uh, that worked on here as well. Um, but it really rocked the baby beast here, and I was pretty proud of it because I got a pretty good, pretty good inhale and puff on it. All right. Anyway, um, yeah. Let me know what you guys think. Oh, I was able to get this uh, right around forty dollars plus a few dollars for shipping online. Not very expensive. So completing my thought about. If you're a newbie, a newbie and you're wanting to step up your game, keep it reasonable. This might be a nice little unit for you. And of course, uh, if you have another compatible tank that's maybe similar, like this Baby Beast, try it out on here. I think you're going to find that you're getting kind of a bigger game inhale uh, with, with this setup, with this rig, without all the price and keeping it simple for you to get to know uh, this type of machine before moving on to something a little more elaborate. Price is reasonable. Anyway, um, let's just chill out and get on out of here, huh? Later. Pulling on a cigarette He's in disguise deep in the dark And in a mix he knows the mark